Hello everybody, welcome back to Mist Survival. I do apologize about last week since I had to combine two episodes into one for the previous week. I didn't have one for this past week. So today we are back finally in Mist Survival and we're going to try and pick up where we left off, which is basically playing with fire. And anybody who has ever seen one of my videos knows that this is a horrible idea, but we're going to do it anyway. Uh, we're going to try and I want to go look over, hang on, hang on, hang on. I want to go look over here at all of these and all of these and see if any of these farms that are on the outskirts are kind of on a flat land area plus i think it might be time to try for one of the tentacle face dudes and see you know if there's a if there's a possibility of taking one of them out i'm not sure how this is going to go guys but either way ah i'm ready by the way, I do, in fact, have the vehicle flipper over device, you know, that thing, the thing that for some reason or another, I can't think of the name of it, uh, carjack, there we go, car flipper over device, holy hell, hey, great, <laughs> that's exactly what I meant, uh, let's see, why does it look like there's a mist coming in or something? I was actually wanting to see if there was a chance we could take over the church. Because uh, I was on some flat land, plus the room was kind of open. So let me take a peek over here first. Uh, I don't think we can. Um, I also don't think I can tear apart any of the stuff that's in here either, come to think of it. So... There's just gonna be a whole lot of junk and things sitting everywhere. It'd be really great for having a, like a big room that's got all of my containers in it, but I don't think it's actually gonna be useful. Sadly, there's not a whole lot of items that we can use to like break and clear out rooms. I know that we can build buildings. Uh, okay, this is one of the ones that's got the heart in it, but it also had the the tentacle face dudes are they still here i did bring extra ammo i do not want to try poking these guys they seem like they could move pretty fast was it this side or the other side i thought it was this side uh this area seems pretty flat i don't think there's very much of this stuff that we could probably move um, there is a pin here. I don't think we can operate any of these doors or anything, but I know that at some point we can get chickens and I can just fill in the parts, you know, that don't open and close. Maybe? Uh, and there is the way right there, so I wouldn't have to build a house in order to take care of this one. This could be an idea could be an idea uh let's run um and check the other side because i kind of like the one that reminded me of outlast for some reason don't know um but we're gonna go check and see whether or not that was one that we could get i don't think there was a very big open area that we could use either can i please get rear view mirrors yes that one definitely works right there yeah i could definitely see where i'm going behind me all right uh what about this one This place kind of has an interesting vibe to it. It's like a whole field right there we could use. Uh, if we were to put lockers and stuff along here, this could be useful. Mm, this is a possibility. The only issue is, the only issue, and it's not really kind of a huge issue, is I could build my own building to use a claim device. This building right here does not have a claim device uh, on it, so... I don't know. I don't know. I kind of feel like maybe it would be useful to have this building. Wait, is there anything over here? I never even checked over here. Uh, uh, there's a wheel. Hose. Cool. I didn't check this side. Hmm. Yeah, I kind of like this one. Kind of. Uh, let's go check that barn down there and see. Oh, hang on. This is the one that's got the little face dudes. 
Okay, okay. Uh, let's see, you've got two of them. Now, I don't know whether or not these guys can climb or jump very high or anything else like that. So they're not going to probably have the same AI as the other dudes. And the other dudes got a little bit of a jump, but they can't climb. Did I check over here in your hay bales? Because there's obviously stuff hiding in them every now and then. Okay. Um, this has actually got a whole lot more room to it over here, to be honest with you. I don't know. He's stuck over there again. Um... Now, the only issue is I don't think I saw the inside of this building. I, I really don't remember if I saw the inside. Can I claim this one or would I have to build something? I also love the windmills, so I kind of like the idea of being in one. Also, do you have a backpack? And what is that? What's floating? Better question. Where did the other dude go? And I tried to get my M4. Uh, apparently I'm completely out of ammo for the M4, so I couldn't bring that along with me. So I'm kind of stuck with the pistol and the shotgun. <laughs> I was not expecting you to be there, sir. Ow. Ah. Okay. Right in the face, I guess? Seeker Claw? Seeker. These guys are called Seekers. Oh my gosh. What is going on with your face? Okay. Well, we took care of one. Yay. That's not actually what I meant to do today, but I guess we're going to do the thing. Um, because it's a rare piece from a mutant, high value in exchange, and is also an important part of science. Scientists want to express... So, it's a currency. Somebody told me that the cigarettes in the game are also a currency. Uh, there's an event dude that can happen, and if you help him whenever events happen, he has sellables. As far as I know, unless it was like a random noise, I don't think I've ever heard an event happen. Is there... Okay, there's no smog in here. Uh, yeah, I don't see a claim on this one either. Okay, now what's the likelihood that I can get on top of something? Okay, I wonder if he can get me here. Probably not, but can I get him over here so I can be on the back of it? Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. Now. Okay. So it's like a, a sweep and a growl. Sweep. There we go. Oh, there's two of them. Well, thank you. That looks so complicated. Okay. Uh, did you... Ammo? Thank you. Hey, it's a bicycle. Too bad you can't claim the bicycle. Okay, so I don't see a way of claiming this. There is a whole lot more room upstairs, though, that's for sure. Definitely a whole lot bigger than the one that I've got. Uh, now, if I put down, like, a building, 
that's got a claim thing on it? How far does that extend? I mean, do I have to worry about the tentacle dudes coming back if I do that? Should I claim... Oh, fishing line. What? Row 1B78-Z. Okay. Um, and should I worry about doing that? Because hear me out. If these tentacle guys only exist in a few places in the world and their claws are currency, should I in fact take a building where they spawn as my own? Because if I do that, there's a chance I'm going to stop their spawn and therefore I can make less money. I mean, like, I could make a basic shelter or a small cabin or something just so I can activate it. I'm not sure how the bases work exactly. I mean, if there's like a, an area where it stops the bad guys from spawning in or whatever, I have no idea how this works. But I mean, I could do just like a, the basic small cabin or even a basic shelter inside this area somewhere. And it does seem really, really cool. I'm kind of curious as to what this is. Or what exists around here, because there's like several towns, plus it's not too far away from this town. And of course... Yep, the music just turned bad. I'm glad I waited. I do kind of like this area, but there's a couple of other spots that I do want to check. Ooh, a chan. I do want to check out a couple other areas, just to be sure, before we do the move. You know what? Since I've already clear cleared the bad guys, can we give it a try? Does this work? Because I also brought grenades with me. I don't know which one is supposed to do it. So, let's see. It's four. Uh, light. Ooh! Okay, that did not turn out very well. Okay, did that do it? Do I need to do more than one? I mean... That didn't do anything. Okay. How many do I have to... Not enough lighter fluid. Are you serious? Oh, and I can't use the existing fire to get it to set more fire. All right. Uh, so what about... What about... This is a bad idea. Uh, let's go ahead and save. I was worried about the Molotovs. Definitely worried about this one. Okay. Are you serious? Let me let me out of the Okay, so it's going to require a lot more of that. Uh, let me grab a couple of things. I can go drop them off at the base before we run away around and do other stuff and things, I guess. But now I'm wondering because most of these are going to be through the mountains, which means that this area right here would be awesome. Central area. What is this? That is probably... It's probably the junkyard, right? There's a mountain on that side, so that's not good either. Oh my gosh. Now, I was also told I could just easily just find me a really good spot with flat area and just build my entire base. And that's entirely possible as well. I would like, to, like it to be semi-close to a river. Uh, is there anything that strikes me as a good spot for that? Down here seems like a good spot for that. Just like in the middle of all of this, whatever this is. 
Of course, right here seems like a good spot, too. There's a lot on this side of the map. So over here is what I keep looking at. Is a dirt road. Just in case, because if it is a compound and there's a sniper up there, if I stick my head over this corner, there's a chance I'll just get shot. And I'm very low on health. Are there people here? I don't see people. Well, look at this view, though! Interesting. Hmm. I mean, now, the only issue is, is I would kind of like to build walls and stuff like that, but this view is so good, I don't think I'd want to. I mean, the flickering lake aside, look at that view! Is that the sawmill, maybe? Ah, there's a lot of loot up here, that's for sure. Yeah, look at that view. Um... How do I feel about this place? I mean, there's a couple of buildings up here that I can claim, so... Yes. I heard a wolf. I don't see a wolf. How do I feel about this area? Could I... I really like this view, so I definitely wouldn't build anything here, but could I turn the rest of this into a base? No, hang on. Uh, one of my biggest complaints is this particular workbench that takes up so much damn room. Yeah, the land is flat enough for me to lay it down in a few places. Okay, that would work. Do I claim this area, though? And I guess since there's, like, more than one follower... Hey, I'll take that. Uh, more than one follower, I can give them each their own little building, maybe? I don't know how much my claim really means anything. They could kind of feel like they have their own building. And I could put most of the ma materials and stuff like that, like in the center of here. Plus we have like a really good view. <sighs> My only issue is I was wanting a bit more... Well, what if I do it like this? Like this is my side that has the good view and I'll just block off that unless... I hear you. Are you going to show yourself? It's going to show itself right before it eats my face. Yeah, it doesn't seem like anything can get up here anyway. And I can do like a lower fence or something like that and then do log fencing around the back. Base shelter is active within a range of 50 meters. 50 meters, so... 50 meters, which would be... You know, I would probably, probably, create one of the basic shelters and claim it right here in the center of this whole thing. What do you think? Nice. Guys, that's, that's just too good of a view. It's too good of a view. We're gonna do this. Okay. Um... Let me go this way and figure out exactly where this road comes out so I know which way is going to be the fastest way of getting all of my stuff and things up here. Yeah, I, I think this is good. It's center of the map. It's out of the way though, so I can do some hunting and the fishing is not that far. I can see it from my base. It's not actually that far from our current base, which means it's going to be very, very quick to get all of the stuff and things over here. 
and I can finally set about trying to put some of the stuff that we have collected into all of the things. Wait, I can't run. No! Uh, drop all of the random stuff in here. Okay. Uh, now, how do I want to do this? I've got like a bed and some other stuff, so I can get Jen to go over there easy on her own. Uh, the thing is, is, well, all of this. Which is the whole reason why I want to why I want to move in the first place, because most of this stuff is actually gonna go into creating my warp bunches. I just haven't made them yet, so I haven't gotten rid of the stuff. Thank God. Alright, our first trip to our new home. Assuming I can find it again. Pretty sure it's this way. I, I keep saying I'm pretty sure I know where I'm at and where I'm going, but that's really and truly just me being um, optimistic. Where is that dirt forward? Is this it? Yeah. There we go. See, what I can do is try and put some uh, lights or something down here, or at least some kind of containers or. Something to indicate that this is the turnoff right here. Okay, dokie. Next load! Uh, we can get all of the stuff and things and then empty them and then take the workbenches and everything else like that. My only issue is, is I need to get some sort of, before I move her out there, I need some sort of security on any of the buildings. Right now I have none and there are no upper, upper levels, so... I kind of don't want to move anybody out there until I've got some sort of defense. I'm not sure if she can get injured or not. There we go. <laughs> okay, this time whenever I go over there, because I'm going to have plenty of time to start setting some stuff up, I'm going to go ahead and get her moved over there too. This time, I'm actually going to make sure that there's no way I can get confused about which way is my... Uh, okay. <laughs> which one is my driveway? Uh, I'm going to put a fake build at the end. Uh, okay. Let me do... Let's see. Build. Do a... Wow, what's a good fake build? Can I fake build these? Yeah. Let's fake build this. There. I should be able to see that from a mile away and know that this is where I'm supposed to be turning off. There. Okie dokie. Now then. Uh, ma'am, I'm gonna have to borrow this from you. Just like a, a split like, could, could you, could you move? Sure. All right, Jean, how are we gonna do this? Okay, there we go. I don't know whether or not any of this stuff is going to stay. Uh, I'll put you up on flatter ground right here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Right there. Uh, the bed didn't stay. Oddly enough, the rest of the stuff stayed, though.
<laughs> and that worked. All right, all right, all right, all right. You know what? You do what you gotta do whenever you're moving stuff. Sometimes the stacking doesn't make sense, but physics, you know? I mean, who, who, who can trust those? Obviously, it, it's just uh, all lies and propaganda as far as I'm concerned. Physics don't exist. It's fine. Oh, I still have to go back and get some more of my stuff and things. This is not even half of what I had. I've got a water thing that I need to go and get to. Uh, start the build again. Are you... still working? Or... Oh my god. Okay. No! 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 What are you doing? Oh my gosh. There we go. Okay, now then. I'm going to claim this one. Teleporter to the base. All right, now then, that one should cover all of these buildings, which is cool. Now then, all right, ladies and gentlemen, I think we're gonna call it here. We haven't really made that much progress, but believe it or not, a lot of things have been made. This is where we're probably gonna sit until, I don't know, probably later game when we start looking at going to the mine or something like that. I'm not sure exactly what all's entailed with the mining part, but as far as me just wanting to hang out in a location and build a base, this is gorgeous, so this is where I'm going to do it at. I will see you guys in the next one. You have a wonderful day, one for that, and you stay shiny. Bye!